Hey guys, welcome back to another Coding Flamingo video. So in the previous videos, we have seen how to install these four Blazor components. You have Radson, you have Mat Mod Blazor, you have Matte Blazor, and then you have Sync Fusion. And today we're gonna compare all four in the three most important categories, in my opinion, that it's its of use slash documentation, uh, looks, and then speed. So we're gonna start with ease of use and documentation. So the first place for ease of use and documentation is actually Matte Blazor. So like they have very easy documentation, very easy to follow, a lot of examples, and it's very similar to the default Blazor. So like there's no mod no not much changing that you have to do to the code to include a Matte Blazor. It's usually just adding like Matte at the beginning of some stuff, like Matte button and stuff like that. So they take first place. Then we have Mod Blazor. Mod Blazor has a little more changes, but their documentation is amazing and they have everything, like every single little thing that you might want to change, they have it in the documentation. Then we have Radson. So the they lose points for having such a hard name to say, in my opinion. No, I'm kidding. Uh, they have good documentation. It's just a lot of custom stuff and like a lot of random code and there's not much support in forums and stuff for it. So uh, but it's very easy to use once you get used to it. And last place is Sync Fusion. So there is no support um, from the community. They, they have some kind of like support that the company gives you. Their documentation is all over the place. You have to like play around between their getting started pages, their documentation pages, their demo pages. So, and there's sometimes that I honestly end up using like the autocomplete and be like, oh, let's see if this works out. So they're dead last by far. So now the second thing is looks. So looks is something that each person is going to judge. You should not base it on mine because I am a backend engineer and I'm awful at designing stuff, but I'm going to give my ranking either way in case you care. If not, you can just skip in the timestamp for the next one. And here, I like the Mod Blazor first, like it's very kind of a modern and like simple design. In second place is Sync Fusion, just because it's kind of simple, like very simple components. It just looks nice, looks clean. Third place is Bat Blazor. I kind of like their purple stuff and everything, but I don't like that their text boxes are so big and so boxy. And there's many things that I usually have to change in CSS. So not a big fan. And last place is Radson just because it looks kind of old. I don't know, like it, it just looks weird and old. I don't know how to explain it. So uh, those are my opinions for looks. And third, the one that I, might be the most important is speed. So for this one, I just kind of did the, the same page for all of them, loaded the same amount of data and did multiple runs to make sure that everything is right. And I checked the size and the load time and we can see here the four so radson mod blazer matte blazer and sync fusion and here you can see kind of like designs as well as i said it's kind of simple a little too boxy for my look but but it looks nice and it has a little purple in there looks clean simple i, I would like a little shade on the back but it's good and then it looks old so without further ado, let's look at the results. So we can see here the speed and package sizes. So first place is Mod Blazor by a lot. Like I was actually surprised about how fast it was. And the package size is way smaller. It's just a fraction of everything else. Then second place is Mad Blazor, which has a way bigger package, but like the time is not as much as the other ones. I was actually surprised that Matte Blazor is larger than Radzen, but it actually is faster to load. And then last place by far is Sync Fusion, which I was actually really surprised because they break down their components. So I only downloaded two of their components while all the other ones I downloaded the whole package. So I was actually expecting it to do way better, but it was last by far. So in conclusion, I thought it was going to be a more contended race. Like I thought it was going to be hey, just based on looks or whatever, it feels more comfortable. But honestly, after looking at these results, I could only re recommend using Mod Blazor. 
I know that's what I'm going to be using from now on. And I actually, while recording this, I was thinking about changing my current projects to Mod Blazer. So that's my opinion. What's yours? Let me know down in the comments down below. If you like this video, make sure to subscribe and like the video. And thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.